motor bottle here. Hey, I've got something I wanted to show you. So, here in central Pennsylvania, we are having a major event going on for Pennsylvania. We have the Pennsylvania Farm Show happening in our capital city of Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. And every year, almost without fail, we get weather that is winter weather. So farm show week happens, generally speaking. I'm not an expert on the farm show, so please don't hold me uh, to this, but farm show week happens the first week of January after the new year. So what happens during farm show week, sometimes, some way, somehow, we get snow. <laughs> it's amazing. You can almost bank on it. So, yes, we got snow today. Today is Tuesday. It's the, uh, the farm show opened last Friday. And so, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. It's the fifth day of the farm show, and we got snow. So, with, that, with that being said, what I want to show you tonight is the edge tamer. The edge tamer, that's what it says right here. Let's see. You might not be able to see it. Hopefully you can, it's focusing on that. The edge tamer is from R2 Manufacturing. What they do is they mount to your bucket. And even if you have a plow, these are also great. You can also use them for soil, moving soil without tearing up your saw it is bad. But what they do is they act like shoes on your loader bucket and keep you from digging up. I have a gravel driveway, so these help me keep from digging the stones out of the driveway and putting them in the grass. So with the size of bucket that I have, you need a set of two. If you have a uh, these will also work on larger tractors. They'll work on green tractors, red tractors, uh, yellow tractors, blue tractors, and orange tractors. They even they come in red. That's the only color they come in as far as I know. And uh, yeah, they just go on your bucket. You mount one on each side. And if you have a tractor with a bigger bucket, if, let's say you have a uh, a 55 horsepower tractor with a 60 inch wide bucket or something. I don't know how, how big those tractors are. You get one, you'll get three of them, one for the middle and one for each side. But on these smaller compact, subcompact tractors, you only need two. And what I think, I used them last year and they were pretty good. Um, when the, the gravel is not frozen, it's easy to dig in. And I do have a plow but the plow is a little excessive for tonight. We just got about two inches of snow out there. And I just want to run this uh, um, loader up and down the driveway a couple of times. It's supposed to stop snowing in about two hours. And so I thought I'd take this opportunity to make this video, put these on, and uh, yeah, show you, bring you along, show you what I do. So I was looking for my white lithium release and course I couldn't find it so what I'm going to just do is use a little bit of a uh, motor oil and lubricate these threads and I'm going to take a three-quarter inch socket put it on my impact wrench and run the bolt down fine threads which is fine there's nothing wrong with fine threads a lot of people think fine threads are not as good as coarse threads that's not true the good thing about fine threads you don't have to apply as much torque to keep this the bolt
that's enough. I have had these fall off, but I don't think it's because I uh, didn't torque them tight enough. I actually put a washer under them and, you know, to protect the paint, blah, blah, blah. Better just to paint the bucket again. But you can see I don't paint my bucket. It is uh, Kubota Bob orange, which just means it's not really orange anymore. So that's it. They've been installed. They install that fast. Now the nice thing about the edge tamer is they have attachments. Believe it or not, the edge tamer has attachments. Let me show you the one I have. This is called the edge extender. I don't know if you can see that or not. Also by R2 Manufacturing. And what it does, it kind of turns your edge tamers into a, uh, a mini forklift. And there's a hole here, and what this will do is mount like that. You put one on each side, and then you can stack two by fours on there, or large branches that won't fit inside your bucket. It's a really handy um, attachment that makes the edge tamer all that more versatile. They're, they're high quality. I'm telling you, this is quarter inch plate steel, good American steel, made in America by two young American men. Got a Made in America sign there. These are well worth their money. If you have a tractor, you want to increase the versatility of your bucket without spending a lot of money, the edge tamer is how you can do it. So check these guys out on the internet. I'll let a link down below to their website if you're interested. Hey, do me a favor, smash that like button. Subscribe if you haven't subscribed already. Share this video with a friend, with someone who could use an edge tamer to plow their driveway. Or, even if you don't need to plow a driveway, these mini forks are really, really handy. I have used them already in uh, uh, cleaning up my yard in the spring. They work great. So with that said, I'm going to call this a wrap. Get on out of here, and uh, see you next time here on Boda Bob.